I have no idea what you're saying. And it's not like I have time to chat, sorry. But go play Mahjong if you're like... <laughs> yeah, okay, old man, you go play some Mahjong. That'll make you feel good. Here's ten bucks, buy yourself a cough candy. Like, <laughs> I apologize if I offended you, but I am uncertain of your present abilities. I will wait and watch you for a while. The look on Kiryu's face is just like... What the fuck? <laughs> Why are we in this conversation? I know you'd not time to have to be gone with you. Hello, Mr. Weapon Shop. Hello. Actually, do you have any weapons? Because I'm pretty sure I wasted nearly everything I had on Majima. Wait, can I not afford... I can't carry any more weapons? Damn, I'm... I'm all slots of my inventory is filled up with lumber. I don't think I need this much lumber. I really don't. I really don't. I'm not erecting a farm. I'm not building a barn or whatever. I've got some space. You got any, uh... You got any weapons? What you got, huh? Warning sign. I like it, yep. Long lumber. Now we're talking, not regular lumber. Table sort master ball. This weapon can apply enough force to knock out your average foe. Hmm. Better get it. Just just for safe. Just just to be safe. Better get the protect myself properly. Time to test out the warnings. One? It's got an attack of... It's got an attack of 500, but it's got a use of one. I can swing that once. Are you kidding me? I'm gonna use my bowling ball technique. Date, no! <gasps> They're lined up perfectly like pins. Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha! It tr why, why, if you're gonna hit someone with a piece of wood, why bother to go to the effort of shaping it in the form of a sword? Like, it's not gonna do any more damage shaped like a sword, surely. Imagine, imagine, imagine like getting a, a piece of wood shaped like a gun just to pistol whip people. Wow, I like teleported behind him. Nothing personal kid style. Whoa! <laughs> Oh, we're going to fight Majima. And knowing my luck, I'm going to fight Majima on the way to fighting Majima. Tell me what happened. One more time, please. Why do I have to keep repeating myself? Some men jumped out of a van, grabbed a little girl, and then drove off with her. And nobody else saw this happen. This is a child to talk about here. You don't believe me? In this town, you have to check the sources, man. That's all I'm saying. I can't, I can't start, start doing police work just because you think you saw something. <laughs> it takes a lot to get me to do something, I'll have you know. Well, I've got actually loads and loads of time between now and saving uh, Haruka, so I can just do whatever I want, regardless of the fact that Haruka is, you know, apparently in immediate peril. To be honest, she's with Majima, so she's probably about as safe as it's gonna get. If you told me she was with, like, Shimano, then I would be like, oh fuck, that's a problem. But, like, she's with Majima? Yeah, she'll be fine. She's pro probably safer with Majima than she is with me. I mean, Christ, I get into fights practically fucking by the minute. Oh! And then they kissed. So, would you like another drink? <laughs> well, if you're offering them. Uh, yeah, let's have whatever this is. To be honest, at this point, you could probably put shampoo in a bottle and Kiryu would drink it. Japan's most popular whiskey must be this Kabukin Japanese whiskey. Okay. It's like the father of Japanese whiskey. Even 50 years after its creation, it's a popular mainstay drink. It's characterized by a sweet fragrance and smooth volume. The Kabukin is not its proper name, but a nickname that came from the shape of its bottle. Oh yeah, oh, obviously, yeah. <laughs> I knew that. Alright, I'm smashed. Man, I've saved a game show host. What are you? You're like... The only blonde guy in Japan. I, I really just... You don't... I mean, look, honestly, look at the street right now. How many blonde people do you see? 
There's really not that many. That's why I kind of find it jarring to see a guy with, like, proper blonde. There's one person who's blonde. Oh, and another one. Christ. The infection spreading. What do you have in the way of, uh, hardcore drugs? Uh, stamina. <coughs> and, uh, some vitamin water. If I can. <laughs> <clears throat> yeah, gotta be careful nowadays. Can't just go running into a fight without, you know, hydration. He traded out his baseball bat for a knife. That's how you know he's serious. God damn it. It's Goro Majima. I just came here for a quiet game of baseball, and what I got was Goro Majima. Build up some heat on these goons, and then unleash my special move. Ah, how do you like my bowling technique, Majima? I've been practicing. It's warning sign time! Really, that did fucking nothing to the one guy I hit it with. You can upgrade abilities. I know! Not that one, though. Boost attack three. <laughs> Always an effect. Uh, I need some of that, uh, one, two, three gum. <laughs> you can't use that here. What? All these, all ones? Can I use my pocket tissues at least? Can I not use my munchan in the heat of a fight? <clears throat> I think it's time to get out. I've shown him my bowling technique. Now it's showing my golfing prowess. <laughs> That'll make him think twice about this. Why were you scared? He's the, he's the safest, most sane person we know. I don't want quick step blow. Where's the one that lets you get off the floor fast? That's all. That what? What's the difference between quick step blow here and quick step blow there? Oh wait, one of them is by. I gotta pay for two different versions of quick step blow because one of them's brawler and the other one's rush. Yeah, I'm buying it, but no, I don't like it. I want double finishing blow, and I probably should have spent my money on that one. <laughs> Where the hell are you? Hang on, this is fucking Majima again. No, 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 I know, I know this bullshit. God damn it. Didn't you just kick my ass earlier? Aren't you satisfied? The street is my domain though. The plastic cage might be yours, but the street is mine. And that's why I'm getting my ass kicked on the street. Hang on, Majima, we're getting closer to something very important. Glowing in the background and an orange aura over there. I really need to go over there and check it out. <laughs> I'll beat you with a wheel if I have to. Don't grab him, grab the fucking sign! What the- <laughs> For God's sake! I was trying to grab the sign right next to me and it wouldn't let me have it, so I went over there to get that one and he fucking does that to me. Fuck you. Get him again, get him again. Get him while he's down, like he did to me. Holy shit, I got 72 experience points there. Fucking, that was just fine Majima once. I can finally have double finishing blow. The hell did that come from? I love double finishing blow. It's my favorite move. Next to the getting up quick move, it's my favorite move. <laughs> Warning you, Majima, I've learned a new move since the last time. That was fucking breaking, Majima. Wow, okay. <laughs> Holy shit. Oh my god. The damage he does, though! Fuck! No, oh, wait, what's this? Pliers. Oh! Oh! oh shit! Oh my god! Oh, there's a mystery needle down there as well. Could he use that? That would have been fun. Seriously, the. the, the what? E, e, dagger, okay. 
Like a mystery needle you find in the street stabbing someone in the ass with a, like a needle you find in the street? Like what possible diseases could you get from that? Like there's, you know, <laughs> there's a... You thought, you thought the worst thing that happened was you got your ass kicked, but like, you know, fucking hep C or whatever from a fucking one of them. Hmm? Oh, it's you guys. You're not still scamming people with that whole bumping thing anymore, right? No, sorry. We're totally reformed for real. These days, we're into power walking. <sighs> this is disappointing. I really thought you guys had more, more, more common sense than to once again pick a fight right next to a fucking bicycle. You guys never learn. Oh, And here I was thinking those obnoxious thugs might have turned around. I hope they're done with these stupid stunts. You know they're not. You know they're not. He's got a knife. And it broke on impact? What was that knife made out of? Porcelain? <laughs> My porcelain knife. The hell are you giggling at? Oh. Oh, excuse me. It's got salary man in brackets. This guy's a pickpocket. Damn. How did it just- oh, wait a second, did it really class that as spending money? <laughs> I paid him for the experience of being robbed. <laughs> it's this guy. It's gotta be this guy. This is the same sub-story- well, it's a very similar sub-story to the one from Yakuza Zero. So she said he was wearing a pair of glasses, a grey suit, and a beige overcoat. So that's- it's this guy. So we're going to accuse a couple of these guys first. Definitely this fucking dude. Look at him. Is this the pickpocket? He looks like he looks like a fucking pickpocket. This is yeah, this this guy's definitely dipped his hands into someone else's funds. Give me back my money. Finally found you pickpocket. Give me back my money. Huh? What are you talking about? There's no way I'm a pickpocket. I just finished up work a few minutes ago. What? Uh, well, now I see he's got different features from the pickpocket. I'm sorry, I had the wrong guy. Hold it, how dare you call me pickpocket like that? You better pay me 10,000 yen for this slander or I'll sue you for more. Really? I gotta pay him? If you don't want to settle this one-on-one, -on -one, then... Really? Wow, okay. What about the next guy? Is he gonna fucking take me to court, or is he just gonna call the police on me? Hmm. Yep, this... Accuse him! Accuse him! Boy. You're the pickpocket, aren't you? Give me back my money! What are you babbling about? I've got out of an interview. Whose pockets could I have picked? Many. What? Oh, I see. Guess he doesn't have the same food. What's this gonna do? Sorry, I'm mistaking some of Hey, hold on, old man. I'm already in a shit mood because I'm bombing my job interviews. If you want to apologize, let me slug you in the face. Oh, well, I'm afraid I'm just gonna have to beat the shit out of you as well. There you go. I'm so sorry about that. Not only did I accuse you, I just <laughs> beat the shit out of you as well. Well, that leaves only this guy. The one who I knew it was from the start. Special stealth technique. Can't see the trees for the forest ability. Huh. Hiding in plain sight is kind of obvious when you've literally accused everybody else in the area. And you've got a detailed... It's like a detailed description. Like the fact that she was like, Oh yes, he's wearing glasses and a beige coat over a grey suit. But I have no intention of giving back the money so easily. Then. What? Now you will face the secret art of assassination passed down to me by my father from generations of master thieves. <laughs> Damn. Oh. Yeah, you got some time you can spare me? Not exactly, but... Oh, 
Right, yeah. I understand. <laughs> Collect bills. Oh, we could play some pool actually. I'm I'm pretty I'm pretty bad at both. <coughs> oh fuck off. No. <laughs> Please. I'm shit at fucking pool. Christ almighty, he's already ready. He's just like, hey, gonna play some pool? I saw you walking towards the pool table there. Oh, Majima. Don't go getting all defensive. I ain't here to pick a fight with you this time. Just wants to play pool. The way you're holding that pool stick looks kind of threatening. Yeah, well, I want to play some damn pool. I don't want to play pool. I fucking suck at pool. I don't want to play pool against him. I wanted to play pool. I don't want to play. I don't want to play for fucking, you know. God damn it. Don't you know there's more to life than fighting? Figure we could change it up and shoot some pool. You know what? You're the one that starts all the fights, you know. You don't want to start lecturing me about having bad things to do. Alright, I'm breaking. Did you hear a word I said? What did you go? Why did you get to go first? Oh, don't even give me a tutorial. I'll just fucking guess. Yep, okay. Yep. I'll just feel it out. I'm just that good. I know, I know, let me play the game! I've played so much fucking Yakuza, I know how to play it, I'm just shit at it. It's not the rules I have a problem with, it's the actual fucking gameplay I have a problem with. Hmm. I very much doubt that I can hit the one from there. Oh my god! Look at that! <laughs> just that good. Just, just, just that good. Holy shit. Okay. Oh my fucking god. Okay, I'm actually I'm actually insane. I'm I'm shit at fighting, but Christ almighty, am I good at pool suddenly? Gotta get the three in there. I'm just gonna try there. Oh, it's the first one I fucked up. <coughs> and I've set him up the perfect easy shot. Mm. Alright, that was a baby shot. Any fool could have done that. Oh my god, okay, is he actually really, really fucking good? I think we're forgetting the fact that I got one and two, really, I mean... That pretty much sets the game going. He does all these gentle little shots and I'm just like... Fucking happy Gilmore of snooker. God damn it, he is absolutely destroying me now. I started off doing really well. He literally sinks every single one that he tries. God damn it. <laughs> He's literally got... I got one and two, he got every other fucking number there. <laughs> He's so much better at it than me. This isn't like darts where it's an equal competition. He's literally just so much better at this than me. Thank you for the replay. I'm not even surprised. I didn't even want to play against him. I just wanted to have a little go. Yeah, <laughs> I win. Now you understand the power of Goro, the ta the table wrecker. <laughs> the table wrecker. I've wrecked a few tables in my time, but not really playing pool. Is he seriously going to wait in here for me to... <laughs> He's sitting on the table. <laughs> you bastard. How are you allowed in here? This is a reputable establishment. Fuck, I know. Like, he's put, no, he's put me off. He's put me off, darts. <laughs> Bastard of achievement. Uh, I'll go to Purgatory's Underground to help out the florist. But do I really want to do that? No, I want to see what's at the bottom of this alleyway. Apparently there's a sub-story down here. 
Uh, is this the sub story? They just got. Wait, is that just like coloring books or fucking manga in the, on that shelf down there? Oh, that's a. Uh, wait, that's a. In as an Empress Cicada, of course. We should really have another go at that game. See if I can master my rock paper scissors skill. Half fried rice extra soup ramen. That'll be zero yen. What? Did you say ramen extra soup side of half rice? The restroom is through the back door. I'll uh, check out this restroom then. Oh, I thought it'd be something interesting. It's just an underground casino. Hi, uh, are you Bun Chan, per chance? All right, just play some blackjack. I'm feeling lucky. This is, what is this? I can't fucking see, camera. Would you like to play some? Yes, I would. This is high stakes blackjack. No, I don't, I don't need a tutorial either. I just wanted to say hi. Where's low stakes back blackjack? <laughs> Ten chips, alright. I'm gonna bet hundred chips straight away because I'm just feeling really confident. Hmm. Hit me. Alright, look at that. It's the dealer's turn. He's trash. He's trash. Yeah! You won a game. The maximum bet is increased to 300. I just took 100 again. I'm not feeling that adventurous. So I've got 20, but like the guy last time, he drew a he drew a, a face card as well. But apparently that didn't count for anything. So I don't understand how this game works. Uh, nah, I'm good. Wait, you can double your bet, but you must draw one more card. No. Split your hand in two. The second hand will mirror. Oh my god, Sorrent folding at this point will return half of your current bet. Now I'm just gonna stand. stand up. Ooh. Yeah, you. <laughs> yeah. I have no idea what I'm doing, and it feels like luck, but I'm winning, and that's good. You won two games in a row, the maximum bet is increased to 500. Well, I'm just gonna have to increase my bet to, uh, 500, yeah, fuck it. <laughs> this is a pretty... big... Wait, so is that 15 now? Because last time it was 6. I got 15, it hit me. Shit. Fuck! No! <laughs> See, the second I actually... Nah, fuck this game. The second that I, like, bid a lot, like, it's just like, yeah, you're gonna lose this one. No fucking chance. <sighs> Underground casinos, they're all the goddamn same. Trade your chips for prizes. Hello? Is there a person in there? Hi, are you trapped in there? Person? Oh my god, it's a talking window. Hello? Why is it crotch height? What are you doing down there? Oh. <laughs> you're looking down like, what the fuck? Wait, is there still a sub-story down there? I thought that was it. I'm supposed to be checking something else out. Does it say on the map what that is? It does not. Just sub story. Hello, we got another one. Small white. The top is small and white. I don't know what else is. Was I supposed to like find somebody in here? Is anybody else here? Uh. Want to talk? Oh, the barkeep over at Shellac needs me to find the Yakuza in a green suit somewhere in the secret casino. He has a debt to repay. The one in the green is that green? That's green? My cataracts must be playing up. To be honest, everything looks fucking green in here. Hey, can I have a word with you? Huh? Who are you? Are you Tano? Fear. Yeah, that's me. What do you want? I'm kind of busy right- No, you're not. You're leaning against the wall looking at your shoes. Yeah. When I used to carry the Goddess of Children amulet on me, I used to win all the time. <sighs> but I got drunk one day and lost it. All I need is that Goddess of Children amulet back and I can pay my tab in full. 
The goddess of children amulet, eh? I don't have anything like that. Without the goddess of children amulet, I can't pay. I'm flat broke right now. I think we've hit a stalemate. Maybe if I find him this and co Really, Kiryu? We're we gonna fucking dance this dance? Seriously? Arthur was expecting us- expecting him to just get us to gamble it back for him or something. Okay, so we need to find the Goddess of Children amulet. I don't know where the fuck I'm gonna find one of them. Oh, maybe that weapons dealer in front of, uh, in the... Maybe the weapons dealer in West Park or whatever will have some. Oh shit, this is bad. How'd it go this far? Shit, let's get out of here. Whoa. What are you doing? We gotta go now. Ignore that guy, <laughs> staring at the dead body. What was all that about? Mm. Hey, are you okay? He's dead. Those two must have mugged him and then... He's clearly beaten, pretty beaten, his wallet's gone. Just take a second to admire the texture on his coat. He's getting a call. Let's answer it. Yeah, of course. It's probably a friend calling. I need to let his loved one know this man was killed. Hello? Papa John's? He hung up on me. Ah, oh, goddammit. He found me somehow. I warn you, Majima. I know what I'm fucking doing. I didn't want to have to do this to you, Majima, but you're asking for it. <laughs> it's not looking good for him. Oh, shit. It's really not looking good for him. I'm going to get some locker key weapons out of these lockers and then you're done for, Majima. Smacked him straight onto his ass. Look at that. Defeat 200 enemies and he was the 200. It wouldn't be surprised if I just said defeat 200 Majimas. Oh, locker keys. Hello. Hey, hold up. Wait. Hang on, are you the same people? I thought I was told to get a locker key. Wait, no, I was supposed to get a locker key. From the bar. Who the fuck are you guys? The locker key you have. We know you. Who gave you that? You bumped into our little friend, right? Then. Who? Oh, yeah, I did. That was the guy who said his Yakuza family were chasing him down to try and leave. Okay. The item in that locker belongs to our family, so just hand over the key and let get out of here. Sorry, but you're in no position to be making claims on my property. Your property? You must be dumber than you look. Oh, I can't believe... No, I believe the guy is immediately to carry who's left is the guy who's dumber than he looks. And when we're done, you're gonna look even dumber. Hang on, guys. I just need to pick something else up before we continue the fight here. Oh. Oh. What's the matter? No! <laughs> I feel like we should be making the goofy noise, you know. You don't know what you're unleashing, man. When you're carrying around what you have in there, you better watch your back. It's the charismatic photo, isn't it? What the hell could be so important to them going here? God, I fucking knew it. Come on, guys, I literally just got out of a fight. <laughs> Oh my god, I can pick this fucking thing up. Alright, guys. <laughs> this isn't looking good for you. No! No! <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ. If I watched someone lift a massive electric box and throw it at someone, I'd be like, I'm leaving. <laughs> Ah, oh, shit, it's Majima again. Yeah, fucking come on, I've just def Oh, wait, is this Slugger Majima? Oh, I'm not Slugger Majima. 
All right, Majima, but I'm warning you. <laughs> this was a bad place to do this. I don't know where you are. Please. <laughs> Holy shit. He's doing shit loads of damage to me. Whoa, where did I get this from? <laughs> ah, my sword's broken. My sword that I wasn't really prepared to crack out is broken. What about lumber? Let's just use... The okay, fine. Lumber it is. It's not long lumber, but it's it's lumber. If only I was more proficient with my lumber use. I need training in the way of the lumber. No! <laughs> He's too powerful! <laughs> bon Chen, what do I do? What do I do, Bon Chen? <laughs> Buffy the Vampire Slayer model. Oh! <laughs> oh, not again! God damn, the damage. Yeah. I'm up here. Right, I keep on coming out of these fights worse for wear, but I keep also throwing myself back into him, so maybe I'm the idiot after all. Second, sorry, I got a I got a text message. I can't be staring at you like this. Cell phone. Who is it? Rena. Come by the club. Oh come on, guys! I'm trying to get to the fucking club right now. Fucking busy. Unless you guys are gonna pay Re my for my Rena money, I'm fucking I'm not interested, huh? Go to Lit Marsh and spend some money on things that raise your masculine appeal. What? Raise my masculine appeal. What am I supposed to do? Oh, there's a sub story? I'm trying to get to Rena. Hmm. <laughs> Can you just thinking about stealing a bike? Alright, yeah, okay. So, yeah, I get the premise of this one. I don't need to read the backstory. It's one of the simplest sub stories in the game. Alright, so they're, they're gonna waltz their way over and be like, Hey, baby. Oh, man, look at them. They're in unison. It's like Britney Spears and her backup dancers. If Britney Spears wore fucking glasses like Better Call Saul in the flashback scenes. Alright, uh... <laughs> he looks like a menacing accountant. And the guy on the right looks like a... Looks like fucking Mike Matai from Cinemassacre. The guy on the left is the... Basically, Asian Neo, and the guy in the far back looks like he's the he's the drummer for a goddamn. <laughs> he looks like a drummer for a fucking for a punk band that's like too old to still be punk. Oh well, this is gonna be over really really quickly. Luckily, they've parked some bikes here. Hmm. I think big bike today, since these are that was a big talking guy. Oh, the big talking guy's already out. What do you know? <laughs> I'm the club's bouncer. A bouncer. 
That's right. And if you ever show your face here again, I'll be here to show you the door. Or more accurately, I'll be showing you the floor. Face first. Get the fuck out of my cl- The other guy's just gone. <laughs> He's just like, oh uh, yeah, I think I'll go, uh, I think I'll go to Kantai or whatever it is, Kanrai, and fucking order a steak instead. I'm gonna become a model citizen. I'm gonna go back to school and study math. Italian scarf. Rena's gonna love that. Cool. It may not be very masculine, but it's definitely for Rena. What the? What the hell's going on here? Oh. God damn it! Another sub story. I'm just trying to get to La Marche. Excuse me, mister, would you like some matches? So your family business is running a match factory. I have no- I, I remember this sub-story, but like, I- I just- I don't remember this sub-story because it's just so... Yeah. It's just not an interesting story, I don't remember what- You think there's some kind of romance going on here, but there isn't, and like... That's it. It really amounts to nothing. Um, I talk more about it, but... It's just not a very in Oh. Fade to black? Am I allowed to cont- Fucking you put me- nowhere near Lamarche! I've gotta go all the way back to- Fucking Lamarsh again! Get out of my way! I just want to go to Lamarsh. I'm supposed to be buying some masculine equipment. Maybe I should just walk in there with like a belt full of hand grenades or something. That'll look good. She's like, "Wow, these hand grenades are really making you look good." <clears throat> That's Popo. Must be. Wait, there's just. Oh come on! I don't want to fucking <laughs> matches. Anybody want some high quality matches? Okay. Finally, after like half an hour, I can. Finally get to La Marche. I think these long camel colored boots will improve my masculinity. That's a bit too much money. Actually, I can't afford any of this stuff that's literally for me. Okay, I need to- I need to dump some stuff from my inventory, apparently, once again. Fuck's sake, I've fucking got a- I've already just got in here and I've already got to fucking leave to go to the item box. Fucking it can all go in there. I don't need half of that stuff. I don't even know what most of it does. Beep beep. Fucking move it loose. Wow, I managed to dodge both of them. Look at me go. But <laughs> I went back to hit that guy. I'm just gonna buy the watch and I'm gonna I'm gonna buy all of them. Oh shit. Now I can't tell which one. Which one's the right one? Italian cologne. Right that one. Uh ba -ba -ba -ba. where's the men's one? Swiss watch is two hundred and eighty thousand. No? I'm a fucking Italian men's necklace, there we go. I spent a lot of money that Rena better just fucking straight up fall in love with me because otherwise I'm gonna be lost. To Rena! <laughs> beep beep! <laughs> just beat the shit out of him, knocking him over. No! Fucking, where's the entrance? Rena, I'm coming! She'll think I'm sophisticated, which is not true. You're so dapper, you look great. I'm wearing literally the same clothes, but I put on, I spent like fucking over like a hundred and fifty thousand yen on a necklace and some cologne, and she's like, "Oh my god, <laughs> Kiryu, what the fuck?" <laughs> Would you like a drink? Yeah, I'll have a. I got some money left. I'll have some uh, black champagne. Tunnel. Alright, everything after this is going to be the cheapest possible thing, because I've already spent too much money. Yeah, wanna go somewhere? Wanna go to karaoke? <laughs> wanna go to some karaoke arena? Please, please say that it's under 300,000. Oof, fuck. God damn it, Rena, you're expensive. Kiryu-san. 
Theatre Square, alright. <laughs> uh oh. I'm fucking dealing with Sonic the Hedgehog here. Okay, it's not like you stand a chance against me though. You seem pretty sure of yourself. Heh, of course, why wouldn't I be? You'll fall prey to my super finishing attack, the Kestrel Punch. Kestrel Punch? I thought this was a bug game, that's a bird. This is ridiculous. <laughs> yes! <laughs> I don't understand what's going on! <laughs> She's trash. But I like her glasses. What? Why did I lose? <laughs> I don't understand. We chose the same one twice and we I fucking lost. Too bad. What the? F Someone explain this to me. Why? Why? Why did I lose health? I don't understand. Kestrel punch? You don't even use the Kestrel punch! Alright, you little shit. You've angered me now. I'm afraid I'm gonna have to pull out my best move, which is fucking just having another go at it. I don't know what I'm doing. Haha, <laughs> loser! Paper beats fucking whatever you chose. Rock! <laughs> You're trash! What do you know? Fucking he went for the same one again! He really is as stupid as he looks. Oh my god. He seriously chose the same one three times. <laughs> Flawless victory! This guy is actually garbage. Darn. How did I lose? You chose the same one three times! <laughs> Even with a really good skill, but your strategy is so out in the open you become predictable. Oh, you realized it, mister. Yeah, he's a fucking idiot. Oh, baby. Oh, they got the local special. The Mexican one, and of course the money one, because Kerry was a gold digger at heart. Oh, <laughs> Super awkward. Right on there. <gasps> That one wasn't any good either. They're all shit. Is that what you're trying to tell me? How can you look at these and tell me they're all shit? This one's this one is the one I'm selecting. <laughs> it looks like he's literally just leaving the town. Fucking you again? Oh, you better not. I want something. My girl wants the entire Wu Fam series. Wu fam? What's that? Well, it's a series of exotic stuffed animals. These are three different toys that make up the Wu fam series. Wu Papa, Wu Mama, and Little Wu Kun. She says she wants all three to decorate her room. Sounds like she's just a match of a handful as ever. <laughs> sure, but that part where it makes her so cute, she knows just how it gets. Well, well, yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, let's, let's, let's not go into this. <laughs> let's, let's not go into this one again. Yeah, anyway, uh, I know what I'm asking a lot, but you, could you have the whole Foo Fam? Do you want to fucking go in there and get everything from this one series? They're not even on display here. I don't know what you're looking at. He's like, yeah, I just want every item in the machine. Just smash, just do what I do. Put your fist straight through that fucking glass and get it out yourself. I need to change, you, change the UFO catcher prizes. You better have changed him. He's put. You just swapped him round, you dick. You <laughs> I need. To, I can't get the ones from his fucking sub story if you don't actually put them in there. You better have done it.
fuck's sake, there's still more bunch hands in there. I don't want that one. Change the UFO catcher prizes. Put the stupid lizard things in there. That's what they want. You better have done it this time. That's it. I'm fucking leaving. I'm not asking the guy another ten times to put the right toys in there. You better not be under there, Majima. You better not be under this fucking cone, Majima. God damn it, he's hiding in the trash again. Nice try, trash goblin. Ow. Fucking... <laughs> God damn it, it's always breaking, Majima. Alright. I'm sorry to do this to you, Majima. <laughs> this isn't looking good for him. <laughs> Shit. Oh no, not again. Oh my god, look at that fucking health regen. Jesus Christ! You bastard! Fucking gotta go back over and get another business bike! God damn! Good job we got so many! No parking! He's trying to stop me from getting to the bike! He knows it's his only weakness! No! <laughs> Alright! You gun fucked up this time, Majima! <laughs> wow, that did a lot of damage. The boss is a little tired from playing with you. <laughs> Are you surprised you probably need a hospital visit after the last one? Jesus Christ, I didn't I thought I thought the end was nine. <laughs> Fuck's sake. Alright, well that's enough for today. I think I think we've reached a limit of what we can do. Oh my god. The classic for sure, for sure. <laughs>